Aloha, all, and welcome back to Let's Play Super Mario Sunshine. I'm Paper Mario Guy, and right now we're staring at a giant X, just because I wanted to explain what these X's and these M's that you've been seeing are. Basically, if you spray the X, the X will go away, and there's another X somewhere in Delfino Plaza that you can find, and there's, I believe in the episodes, uh, there's actually... Uh, things like that, too. This one is behind this little, uh, hut thing over here. But you run back there and you get a blue coin. But like I said, I'm not getting the blue coins now. Uh, so that really doesn't do anything for me. And if you were to go up here and smash this box, there's an M. And if you spray the M, then there's a blue coin. Uh, so I'm not going to be getting those. But I figured, you know, before someone asks, um, or maybe someone already has, uh, I don't know, um, but I would, uh, just see. What's that? Hold on, I smell it. Something's going to happen. But where? Where is it? Well, it's over there. It's right in front of him. I mean, we can see it quite queer clearly. Not queerly. Mario! <laughs> Must be there. Spraying me in the face with water and stuff. And, ooh, and the piano with a tank top. Hello. You want to go out to that island? All right, then. Hop in there and cover your ears. Ooh, what is this? Well, this is World 4, Pina Park. Jump into the cannon and get shot off. And that looks like it was way off. Doesn't even look close to the park. So, episode one, Mecha Bowser appears. So, Peanut Park is a pretty cool area. Um, and I'm sure a lot of people's favorite areas, just because, I don't know, it has the whole theme thing going on. It has the nice beach, you know, the sunny atmosphere. Well, everything's sunny in this area. Uh, but, yeah, I mean... People probably really enjoy this area, and I do too, but it just doesn't, it, I don't think it's as good as, say, you know, Gelato Beach or Rico Harbor is so far. Now we have another Shadow Mario chase, so let's chase him down, because we need this guy to give Princess Peach back. I'm tired of her getting kidnapped. Amazing! What a spectacle! Is this our new a new show of ours? You guys are great. Whoever hired you needs a raise. They're getting a promotion. I love how you play the fearless hero and he's like a bad version of you, but you both look the same and stuff. Well, as director of this park, I want you to ensure your success. So how about I provide you with a hero's vehicle? Follow me! Well, how kind of you, Mr. Old Noki, sir. So, this is a pretty unique mission. I don't think uh, I've ever played anything quite like it before or since. Um, basically, Mecha Bowser, driven by Shadow Mario, um, is, uh, is going to be attacking us. Um, and when he attacks us, uh, we have to 
um, you know, spray his fire out. But, um, most of the time he actually just attacks us with bullet bills. Um, and we just have to spray the bullet bills and they'll explode and it's all fine. But we need to shoot him with, uh, these rockets to get direct hits as Flood is saying to us. And, uh, he'll go down easy peasy lemon squeezy. Corona Mountain. Wow. So, that's a turn of events. But, uh, I think pretty much everybody knows the story of Super Mario Sunshine at this point. But, Bowser Jr. is actually Shadow Mario, but for some reason, he still goes around as Shadow Mario for the rest of the game. But I don't think it really matters. Mario's content for right now because he has a brand new... Shine! So, that's good for us and good for business. And we are up to 13 stars, and that's pretty good. Um, and the thing is, I don't really feel like going to Pina Park right now. Pina Park has some pretty cool missions and some pretty interesting missions. But I'd honestly, uh, this is going to be a shorter episode. I don't really feel like, um, you know, making this too long and I'm kind of strapped for time. So instead, we're going to do another bonus mission for you guys. Uh, another mission that, or another star that you can find, or shine, I'm sorry. Shine that you can find right here in Delfino Plaza. That's really easy to get. So walk into this building and talk to this dude. And he says, break all the crates within 30 seconds to win a prize. You want to try, and of course we're going to say yes. And all we have to do is use our little actual box breaker technique. And uh, we'll be just fine. This is really easy and... Uh, you know, doing it is a cinch. Um, probably the easiest shine in the game. Besides maybe, you know, any of the Gooper, or the Piranha Goop fights. So, we have plenty of time to spare. Eight seconds, or seven seconds. And that was great. You are the best. And there we go. We got a shine. Um, which is nice. Uh, but I think that just about does it for this episode, because, you know, we got a shine! 14 shines in five episodes. I know only two shines this episode, but you'll have to deal. And the next time, we will do some more stuff. So until then, I'm Paper Mario Guy, and I'll see you guys all next time.